grand old partisan, celebrates more than 17 decades of Republican heroes and heroics. Today, I highlight a classic speech by President Calvin Coolidge. September 1st, 1924, he explained the true meaning of Labor Day. Quote, I cannot think of anything that represents the American people as a whole so adequately as honest work. We perform different tasks, but the spirit is the same. We are proud of work and ashamed of idleness. With us, there is no task which is menial, no service which is degrading. All work is ennobling and all workers are ennobled. If anything is to be done then by the government for the people who toil, the cause of labor, which is the sum of all other causes, it will be by continuing its efforts to provide healthful surroundings, education, reasonable conditions of employment, fair wages for fair work, stable business prosperity, and the encouragement of religious worship. This is the general American policy, which is working out with a success more complete for humanity with its finite limitations than was ever accomplished anywhere else in the world. The door of opportunity swings wide open in our country. Through it, in constant flow, go those who toil. America recognizes no aristocracy save those who work. The badge of service is the sole requirement for admission to the ranks of our nobility. I want to see our institutions more and more humane, but I do not want to see any of the people cringing suppliants for the favor of the government when they should all be independent masters of their own destiny. Back to basics for the Republican Party is my civil rights history of the GOP. To quote the book, the more we Republicans know about the history of our party, the more the Democrats will worry about the future of theirs. For more information, see grandoldpartisan.com.